So uh, Hunter obviously really had everything going today. Mm -hmm. What did you see from him? I mean, it, it, the, the past three starts, um, just the ability to throw a slider and just the confidence that he's continuing to get with it, just throwing it behind in counts, early in counts, put away to strike guys out um, and just uh, getting ahead. Uh, I mean, he did an unbelievable job. One pitch, the hanger to bow, and, and there's really two pitches all game. It was, and he hit, obviously hit both of them. I mean, other than that, everybody, everybody did well tonight. Hunter pitched phenomenal. For the faces loaded jam, you could see the emotion that he had pounding his chest after getting out of that. Just what does that say about his development? What was some, some of the conversation you guys had leading up to that? Yeah, uh, I, personally, I love it because he, he doesn't really show a lot of emotions. He's, he's a very steady, steady-minded guy, and um, when, he, when he gets fired up, it's just really fun. And uh, it was a huge jam. I, it was Chapman, I believe, right? I think it was Chapman with the strikeout. Um, yeah, I'm, I, think, I believe it was on a slider as well. Um, I love it. I love when he shows emotion. Just he's into it. He's into the game. He cares. He cares a lot. That's uh, the second slider you speak of, though. Process of the first pitch to Bichette. Where did you want that pitch, and what what happened on that swing? Yeah, uh, it, it was it was just a hanging hanging break ball, and that's something uh, that he hits really well. Um, not necessarily not necessarily say that it's it's a bad pitch. Um, he, he just got one that you can handle. He was on time and. Uh, that's what guys obviously do. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, his, his, his uh, I think it was the first at bat. Um, struck out, I think it was like on four sliders or something like that. Um, and then he obviously forced us to throw one over the plate and he didn't miss it. You know, Hunter didn't throw the change up at all. You guys didn't throw the change up all, at mm -hmm. all today. What allows him to be kind of, to, to have that kind of success he did with just two pitches? Um, I mean, I know there was only one one lefty in the lineup, um, so um, there wasn't really a need to throw it um, in the situation with Tapia. But um, I mean, like, even when we had our conversation uh, before the game, changeup is there for a lot of the guys, um, and I think it's just obviously picking our picking our spots when we need to do it, and we don't we don't need to force it, especially the confidence that he's having with his slider. Like, don't force something that. He, he doesn't feel comfortable with right now, but um, it's a work in progress, and I mean, it, his slider has come a long way. And it feels like his slider is like there are two different sliders, so that's kind of like a third pitch. Yeah, kind of, yeah? yeah. I mean, just the ability to, to throw it harder and have it shorter versus something with slower with b bigger break. Is there a <clears> call for that on your wrist? No, <laughs> no. It, he can mani manipulate it how he wants. I mean, there's a ton of guys that are like that. Right. Yeah. And that's pitching. Yeah, yeah. Literally, yeah. Tyler, what made Manoa tough today? Uh, he was just pounding the zone, getting getting ahead in the counts. Um, he's, he's got four-seam sinker and a slider, and he was just pounding the zone with all three. So he, he did a great job tonight.